What it do YouTube, it is your boy Imaginism, back at you with another video. And today's video, we're gonna talk about books that have helped me through my life and through my journey, why I think you should read these books. The first one we're gonna go into is Think and Grow Rich. This book has changed my life. You guys already know in the previous video. However, I just want you guys to actually understand that 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 book has changed my life. And there's another book that I don't have at the moment because I let one of my uh, close friends read it and it's called Seven Spiritual Laws of Success. I'll put the book right here. So basically what it is, is just a book that gives you seven steps to create your reality. And you know, just starting off with little steps of what you should do for yourself. And then the next book we have is Be Obsessed or Be Average. And this book is by Grant Cardone. And this book is, is, is very good. It's just talking about his addiction with drugs, alcohol, and how he, came, how he was at his lowest and how he actually progressed and be one of the richest people out here um, in real estate. And actually he's very, very, very successful. And you can even, he has his whole own books already. And it's very good to learn from other people too through their mistakes. And then another book I have, this one here is really, really good. Tim Gover, Relentless. And man, this book, if you guys don't know who Tim Gover is, Tim Gover is basically Michael Jordan's personal mental coach. He's actually coached for D. Wade and Kobe. So basically he shows you how he basically mentally prepared them for the game. Because at the end of the day, you need physical and however, it all revolves around your mindset and how you look at things too. And that's the reason why MJ, Kobe, and Wade and all of them were the greatest is because they had mental. Their mental game was so um, beyond this earth. And that's the reason why they're the best. However, though, that's an audio book that's actually out that you can actually listen to. And both of them too, Seven Spiritual Laws of Success and The Think and Grow Rich. There's a full audio and all you gotta do is just put on some headphones and just every night just listen to it while you fall asleep. That's actually the best time to really read is when you read a physical copy until you, you know what I mean, you get that retire and then just throw on some headphones and just go to sleep. You know what I mean? And, and, and subconsciously you'll pick that up. And another book that uh, helped me through my journey is I don't have the book right now. My boy Hardini is actually reading that book right now. And it is 52 steps to turning your talent into a skill. And this one I like about it because it's very small. It's not long at all. It's basically, he just shows you how to take uh, baby steps into turning your talent into a skill and to really mastering your craft. Every chapter is like very small. Some of them are like three to even two pages long and that's pretty much it. The first one I'll give it to you was basically study who you want to become. Vision yourself who you want to become and, and before you even practice whatever it is. And that right there is already big, you know what I mean? When you, before you go play a football game, you know what I mean? Watch the greatest and then go out there on the field and I guarantee you'll have a different mindset and a different way of playing because you already envision the best so what do you want to do you're gonna be the best like I said these are just simple books that I've read you know what I mean you guys can take and apply in your life and I guarantee you it'll change your life dramatically like literally you'll you'll see outcome change however though when you read these books it's one thing but when you apply the knowledge in the book into your life and that's when you'll really see the true power work and, and you'll see the universe work in your favor. That's where people get mis misled is because they read a book and they think that by them reading it, it's automatically gonna happen. No, you gotta actually apply the book. Imagine these books are cookbooks, okay? You don't just read a cookbook and wake up and it's done, the food is there. No, you actually have to do step by step and then boom, you come out with this amazing five-star meal. And like I said, it's all about how you take your life and how you perceive it, you know? So I just wanna give you guys books that I've read that helped me and I know this, these books will help you. And there's another one, if you guys don't know, I'll put the link in the description. It's called Your Wish Is Your Command. That right there is the biggest. Uh, uh, if you don't know nothing about anything, a law of attraction or anything, I think you should start off with this first, is Your Wish Is Your Command. And it's just, it's 13 hours and change long videos of audio, but I promise you, he literally breaks down, Kevin breaks down every single detail about life and and how life really works 
And if you guys don't understand that, man, like, just go check it out for yourself. I promise you, he will not let you down. And like I said, man, if you guys have liked this and it's helped you, please smash that like button. Don't be afraid to show this to your friends and give them some encouragement to want to better themselves. And like I said, this is just here to help you experiences and things that I went through that I'm able to give back and to show you guys that this is the way and this is how you can do it to better your life. And like I said, I'm thankful and grateful for everybody. I love you guys. Stay tuned for the next video. I'm out.